Welcome back to the Solent's customer video series. In this video, we're going to go over the alarms that can be found in your Solent's cloud account. Now, in a previous video, we discussed how to set up these alarms. When you're first connecting and programming a Level Center device, you have the option of setting alarms that will be triggered when there's a low level or high level or a percentage change in one of the parameters that's being measured by the connected data loggers. So if you want to learn more about that, make sure to go back and watch the video about connecting a device to your Solon's Cloud account. Now here we are in the dashboard of Solon's Cloud. This is what shows up, of course, when you first log in. And you can see here right at the top in your projects list, there's this little legend. It's showing you what each color of icon means in terms of the alarms. So you can see in project one, right beside the name, there is a red alarm icon, which means that an alarm has been triggered for that project. Whereas you can see here in the default first, my first project, there has been no alarm set up. You can also see rear right at the top that there is an alarm icon. That just tells you there's been an alarm triggered somewhere in your account. These other icons allow you to drill down a little bit more. Same with the map, as you can see, the location icon is red. That's just showing you that there has been an alarm triggered for that exact location, that exact device. And if we drill down even more to this project one under devices, you can now also see that exact device has an alarm triggered for it. And if we click even further into that device and scroll down in its level sender settings window, you can see a list of the actual alarms that have triggered for that specific device. So here we can see it's just one and it's been triggered for a high level alarm. And here you can also see this tab. So um, you do set up an alarm recipient list when you first program your level sender, but you can also do it after the fact. Even when the level sender is running in remote, you can add other recipients to receive those emails that an alarm has been triggered. And also there is this actual alarms menu option. Now this is going to show all the alarms that have been triggered in your entire Solence Cloud account. Right now it is just the one alarm that has been triggered. So you can see the details for that. And once you've taken care of or don't need to be told about this alarm anymore, you can clear the list and that should be everything. That's all you need to know about the alarms other than you will receive an email. So with all these notification, email notifications and icons, it's going to be really hard to miss when there's been an alarm triggered in your Solon's Cloud account.